What I saw is an indication that you have improved on your skills. On behalf of the Chief of the Defense Staff and all the service chiefs and the rest of the Ghana Armed Forces, I want to say thank you very much and we look forward to hosting such training exercises in future. You know what? I finally made it <laughs> to the Jungle School of Warfare. I've been a war school. I made it to the Jungle School of Warfare. When I did the military video, I did not know about that. It was after I've done the video, I got comments talking about Jungle School of War Warfare. I decided to go and look. <laughs> because you know i think i did like the junior training of the military mm -hmm. the military these ones are incoming the babies the newly recruitees the ones that are coming into the force they were the ones i did a video on not the actual training of soldiers <laughs> So I decided out of busybody to go and take a look at the jungle warfare in Ghana here. But a whole lot of things have changed. And by the way, did I say welcome to my channel? Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, hi, Lillian here. And thank you so much for coming. And I do hope that you subscribe to the channel and that you will like this video. I wanted to see how things are done there, but things turned into something else you guys i posted a video here the other time talking about how the u.s soldiers came to ghana to be trained by the ghanaian soldiers right for me i thought that was a new thing i did not know that this is something that happens on a yearly basis what really sparked my curiosity is because of some of the comments i was getting oh they don't go to war what makes you a good soldier when you don't go to war i did not know that they have so much more than war going on for them in ghana you guys we are going to take a look at these videos bash by bash where do we start from let's start from anywhere all right let's take a look at this <music> Let me welcome you uh, to Army Headquarters on behalf of all the officers, the soldiers, and uh, civilian employees. The relationship between the U.S. and Ghana, I cannot really overemphasize because I think you are very privy to the sort of support you've been given us. We continue to enjoy the traditional support that we get uh, through the courses that we embark on overseas especially in the united states and in germany thank you very much uh, we continue to look forward to working with you uh, and i believe that our joint effort is going to ensure peace and stability we are here really on behalf of general williams mm -hmm. the commander of u.s army europe and africa mm -hmm. we are grateful to you for the invitation to be here and to, for the time we'll spend talking together about uh, what we can do together we appreciate your partnership your friendship and look forward to these next few hours together which will just really help us to define some of the objectives that we will pursue so thanks for that reception and a welcome thank you very much. we always say that the jungle is neutral and there are no frontages challenging part of jungle warfare i believe was uh going through the water in the tunnels the smaller tunnels when they said it's neutral, it's, it's with you or against you. I mean, one minute you could be up, next minute you could be down. Be patient. But practice makes perfect. So if they don't practice, they might forget. But as they keep practicing, they become perfect. Every day you're going to expect to get wet, so you kind of just get used to it at that point. It still sucks. I think the best part, though, was doing the river crossing. Your whole body's wet. You just kind of don't care at that point. And then getting out of the water, your body felt like 100 pounds heavier. Fighting in the jungle, it's gonna be the first person that enters the jungle before you can be able to defeat him. What you think hard? You need physical strength. You need everything to make you strong to be able to, to, to get the enemy. The jungle is like that piece of brush you can move around, except it's just everywhere. You can't move around because it's the entire jungle, so you gotta push through it. The men move together. They leave anybody behind. 
main things out here is noise discipline, light discipline. So pretty much we have to make our presence uh, pretty much unknown. Um, we make this hissing noise to get uh, other people's attention, so it's kind of like tss. Save your life first. The rest will be taken care of by the medical charge. So as soon as you get your objective. Now you will begin to wonder how it is very easy for Ghanaians to get visas to countries around the world. Yeah, it's very easy. I mean, can the U.S. Embassy say no to a Ghanaian who wants to apply to move to the U.S.? Uh, on what grounds? Like when they are doing real things with your country, real things, real things. Mind you, these videos I'm displaying on here and the ones I'm going to display, the ones I have played and the ones I'm still going to play. I did not get them from the Ghanaian space. I got them from the US military zone. Like this is something they are putting out here proudly. Do you understand? Oh, <laughs> why am I not Ghanaian? Eh? Yeah, no, I'm not talking about the one you are telling me to become the Ghanaian by paper. It's not enough. I know that can help me to benefit some things, maybe get the passport and all of the good things. But I'm talking about becoming make it be say here in my country. You guys, I would have done the most. <laughs> Ah, I would have done so much. Like, uh, I would have joined so many things. Only me, I would join the army. Only me, I would join the police. I would join politics. Only me, I would do so many things. Only me, can that be done? In <laughs> Anyways, maybe sometimes we overreact. Let's go back and see the new soldiers that are coming into Ghana <laughs> to be trained by Ghanaian soldiers. Aus dem Nebel heraus Bring dich wieder zurück nach Haus yeah. Lass uns den Schritt nach vorne gehen Zusammen in die richtige Richtung drehen Ich fühle dich sicher von Ost nach West Komm halt dich an mir fest For us to survive in the jungle, depends on our will to survive. If you don't have that will to survive, you will never make it. Two, you must try at all possible things to conserve water and food. If you find yourself in this situation and you have a small food on you, don't take everything. Try and preserve your food because you never know the time that it will come for you or you never know the time that it will rejoin your troops. Finally, I want to tell you that let's all take this lesson very important as one day we will come across this situation. Are there any questions? Suggestions? Okay. US is not the only country that comes here to train, okay? But I was looking to see if I would see my own country soldiers coming to train. I couldn't find a video yet. I have not been able to find a video. Hopefully, I will find a video or maybe that has never been the case. And yeah, I am wondering, why not? I mean, why not? If America, when you say, oh my God, see, yeah, yeah. Don't say I'm overhyping them, but come on, they have the money. They have the ammunition, they have the manpower, but for them to still know that there is something that they don't have, that thing can be found in Africa, in Ghana, it simply means that something, they are getting it right. That jungle warfare, it's good. Something they did, when we say, it did, they, for them to have come first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, many, 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 many more coming, and they are still coming. It shows you that it's good. 
Because America of all people, America is not a country that deceives themselves. We know them for sure. They can deceive you, but they don't deceive themselves. For, for them to keep coming to Ghana to train, hmm. Now I see why it's easy for you guys to get passport to go to anywhere you want. Who want to say no to you? Nobody want to say no to you because you have so much to offer them. No, if, if you just close your eyes and say Ghanaian, you go to the embassy, the American embassy, you have all that is required of you. Let's go back and see more. There are so many. There are so many. Ghana don't they rule the world. Like Ghana don't they rule the, Ghana don't they rule the world. <sighs> Bring dich wieder zurück nach Haus, ja. Yeah. Lass uns den Schritt nach vorne. African lion improves our collective ability to confront an increasingly dangerous and an increasingly unpredictable world. The cornerstone of this exercise is interoperability and relationships. In Ghana, we conducted joint and combined training in operational planning, small unit tactics, medical engagements, and civil military humanitarian actions. Each activity has demonstrated for all to see our cohesion, our resolve, and our shared commitment to security in Africa. African Lion has shown that we are truly stronger together and that our strength lies in our partnership. As we near the end of this exercise for this year, I encourage everyone to carry forward the lessons learned. In order to fight emerging threats, there's a need for collaboration, there's the need for jointness, there's the need for unity. No country can do it alone. What I saw is an indication that you have improved on your skills. On behalf of the Chief of the Defense Staff and all the service chiefs and the rest of the Ghana Armed Forces, I want to say thank you very much and we look forward to hosting such training exercises in future. Sorry, I'm not jealous, okay? But I wish, I only wish. <laughs> it's not jealousy for me, but it's just a wish that, oh God, if I, see, you guys, you don't know that if I'm from Ghana, you see this town, this Accra that I'm living in, nobody will see me here. Now, I'm not talking about traveling abroad, but you see this country, if I'm from here, I will just stay in my own path. Like, God can't bless me. Uh, say, my parents based in a village. I was born in a village. I have like a, a village or a hometown. Not even a hometown. A village, please. Guys, I will not... You see this Accra? I won't come here. I will just be in the village. I will just be in my village. And just basically... Oh, dear Lord. Thank you, Jesus, for everything. <laughs> You guys have so much more that you know. I didn't know about the jungle warfare and I'm publicizing it here today for those that didn't know, those that are like me. Mm -hmm. If you're from my country, you see this. Talk to, do, announce it. Maybe, maybe our soldiers too, they can come. They can come here. Do you understand? I know we have good soldiers. I won't lie. It just whatever sabotage them from doing their job. The, their helps that makes them inability to 
completely deliver and defeat maybe if they come here they will find solution anyways this video is about jungle um jungle warfare <laughs> jungle warfare school okay and i hope that you did enjoy it and that i will see you again in another one to do